Hey folks, Gary and Carl in Mosses Creek Outdoors. This is a straight up video on the Wingwood Turkey Call. Uh, whether you have ordered one directly from me or from a outdoor slash hunting supply retailer and you're wanting to know a little more about the call, say you've, you've, you've already got the call in hand, but you don't know completely in full how to use a call of that style, such as a trumpet style, wingbone, yipper, uh, style turkey call so what I'm going to do I'm going to give you a couple of sounds on it and give you an idea of what it sounds like uh, this is the cedar call this is what most of my wingwood calls are made out of the cedar and I have done one out of maple this is a maple call uh, it's got some wormholes in it and uh, of course, I filled all of that. I do take custom orders and make calls out of some other different types of wood sometimes. You know, if people request they want something kind of special. Um, this green call, this is still a cedar call. And what I have done, I dyed the call. It's still made from red cedar, but I just dyed it. It's kind of interesting how some of the grain showed up in it there. But I can make one out of anything you want. You know, if you come across a, a special piece of wood you want to call made out of, you know, you can you can send it to me and I can just make one out of about anything. But I'm just going to give you a, a run on this cedar call. This is the standard call. I'm going to do a yep. I'm out here in the creek bottom, so it's going to sound a good bit different than it would in my shop or inside another building somewhere. That's the calling about as loud as I can call. I'm going to muffle it down here and do a tree call. Grip it real tight and get that small chamber. This call also, it's a little more than just a, a simple piece of wood with a hole up in it. Um, this call is a very tedious call to make. I have to put a, a lot more than what a lot of people would imagine into the making of it. It's, the, it's to do with the length of this barrel, and it's also to do with the hole that's up in the barrel. That hole has got to be made right, especially up inside the call, or the call will not sound right. You will not get those breakover yips. You're just going to get, you know, just a just a bland, straight out sound. So there's that hole tapers up inside the call, and it gets bigger as it comes out to a certain extent, but. There's some real specific, tedious measurements that I go by when I actually drill that hole up in the call to get that just perfect, to get the sounds that I want to get from it. So if you hadn't already got a wing wood and you love trumpet calls or you're a big fan of a wing bone call, uh, you need to get one of these, contact me. 
or you can contact Midwest Turkey Call Supply out of uh, Missouri, MidwestTurkeyCall.com. Uh, it's a really fun call to use, really effective in calling turkeys. And uh, if you're a big fan, like I say, of wing bone calls, you'll definitely be a big fan of this call because it's the same basics as far as learning to use a wing bone. But you won't regret it. So if you ain't got one already, contact me or the retailer that I just told you about. And thanks for watching this video from Mosses Creek Outdoors. We'll see you next time.